Iraq seeks release of funds from U.S. banks in August 2024. Iraq's efforts to regain control over its funds held in U.S. banks have escalated in August 2024, reflecting a growing frustration with the limitations imposed by the United States on the use of Iraq's own financial resources. Background, Iraq's funds in U.S. banks since the end of sanctions, Iraq's oil revenues have been stored in an escrow fund managed by the U.S. Treasury. This arrangement was initially intended to ensure the funds would be used for humanitarian purposes and to prevent any misuse by the Iraqi government. Current situation, talks with U.S. Treasury Iraq is now engaged in talks with the U.S. Treasury regarding its banks and the restrictions on dollar transactions. These negotiations are crucial as they aim to address the issues surrounding the use of Iraq's funds held in U.S. banks. Iraq's motivation independence and control The Iraqi government is eager to gain full control over its financial resources, particularly as it is no longer subject to sanctions. The desire to manage its own funds stems from a wish to reduce dependency on U.S. financial oversight and to use the money for domestic development and economic stability. Challenges Terrorist financing concerns one significant hurdle in Iraq's quest for financial autonomy is the U.S. Treasury's concerns over potential terrorist financing. An Iraqi bank, Al Huda Bank, has been cited by the Treasury Department's Financial Crimes Enforcement Network FinCEN for its role in facilitating funds for foreign terrorist organizations, including Iran's Islamic Revolutionary Guard and its Quds Force as well as Iran-aligned Iraqi militias.